There's a double Dutch bus coming down the street. Moving pretty fast, so kind of shuffle. Hey guys, so today I'm doing a look by Raven Simone, which is just a really smoky eye. And honestly, I can say I've never worn this much makeup on my eyes before. It's just very dramatic. And when I was doing this, I was freaking out. I was like, I look like I'm doing gothic makeup. But I think you guys could wear this look out to dinner or to a dance. Um, one thing I do talk about, though, is just make sure you stick with a nude lip, very neutral lip, maybe just lip gloss, because the eyes are so dramatic. So let's get started. All right, so first things first, we're going to prime our eyes with Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. And I am absolutely in love with this stuff. We're going to put... Usually I just put like a tiny bit on, just mainly over my lid, but really make sure you bring it up all the way. And since we have shadow underneath, you're going to bring some underneath. I am going to use just a flat brush like this, and this is from Crown Brush Kit. Let me show you real quick. I'm not going to really give you the whole shebang because I'm going to do a review on these, but just... Listen for the hallelujah chorus. Those are my brushes. When I mess with underneath, my eye starts to water, and then it just gets impossible to put anything else on. So I'm going to try not to make this one water. All right, now this is my Kat Von D True Love palette. Love it, you guys. I'm using this, like, every day. And these are the colors. Really, it's awesome. So I'm going to take some of the white, and really a little bit goes a long way with this, and I am going to put that in my inner corner and down my tear duct. And just a little bit more to lighten that area up. Okie dokie. Okay, and then whenever I'm done with the color, I just flick off the color like this, and I am going to get... Some of the black there in the middle. Hey, Raven. <laughs> I'm using her as my inspiration, so I'm looking her at her pictures on the side. Then I'm just going to start patting this on my lid. Just working the color in for now. And I'm going to bring it up into my crease. And I'm for sure going to need a little bit more. Wow, that's dark. <laughs> okay. I think I'm going a little crazy here with this. Yeah, now I'm going to get my blending brush. It's an angled blending brush, which I love. And then I'm just going to start blending this out. We don't want that harsh line between the white and black. No, we don't. Kind of little circles, windshield wiper motion, you know. This is actually a really fun look. Sorry, I don't know why I just said that. It's just I've never done anything this dark before. And I think it's just because I don't really go anywhere that fancy. But this look would be good for birthday party. I'm thinking like out to dinner with your friends, you know, where you get dressed up and cute. Okay, now, this is like a little dome brush. And it also came in the same brush kit. I'm going to take the black. This is scary because this is what scared me on the other part. And I am going to line my lower lash line with the black. Trying not to make it water. <laughs> this is just so dramatic for me. <laughs> Look at me double time in my brushes. Obviously, you guys don't have to make this as harsh if you don't want to, but I'm just really trying to go for Raven's look. So, 
Now on to eyeliner. I'm going to take an angled eyeliner brush. Love this thing. And I'm going to take Bobbi Brown Gel Liner. And it's just in the color black. And I'm going to just give this a couple pats in here. I envy people who don't have to pull on their eye to do eyeliner, who can just be like, do do do, mine just doesn't turn out straight that way. Guys, when I try to line my waterline, my eye always waters so much, it just never works. So I usually just end up lining like just underneath, but her look, she clearly has her waterline lined. And a waterline is just that line right there. So I'm going to do that. Oh, I'm sorry. This is just a CoverGirl, it's all rubbed off. Just a CoverGirl Black Onyx eyeliner and it has a really nice smudger at the end. Please don't water, please don't water. My eye just cooperated totally. Now, I don't know, I'm talking like I'm a baby. Now I'm going to. Okay, now I'm going to curl my lashes and doing it again. Have you ever tried curling your eyelashes after you use mascara? It kind of hurts because it like gets stuck to your eye. You guys can't see my eyelashes in this at all. In the camera. I don't know why. Okay, and then I'm using, I must really like CoverGirl. I'm using CoverGirl Lash Blast, I always get tongue tied on this, Lash Blast Fusion Mascara. And I really like this mascara. I've heard a lot of beauty gurus say that if you're all about like getting designer products and stuff, don't waste your money on mascara. Mascara's mascara. Honestly, it's a black, it's black and, or brown, whatever color you use. How do I describe this? It's just, it's mascara as mascara. Nothing special. I'd spend $8 versus like 38 if I were you. Now I have more on this side than this side, oh my goodness. Okay, and then whatever is left on here, I'm just going to take a little bit underneath. Raven has a very nude lips because the eyes are so dramatic. So I'm just going to use a Nivea chapstick. And then, um, what do you know, CoverGirl lipstick. I don't really wear lipstick, but... This is just kind of a nude color that I found in my house. <laughs> Very nude. And then I'm just going to go over it with a cheap NYC kind of light pink gloss. I would never do like dark lips with this look. Well, this is the look, and I really like it. I think it makes my brown eyes stand out, but honestly, I think it would make any color eyes stand out. So, I hope you guys liked this, and comment if you have a really good smoky eye look. Bye! Guys, I just want to say I'm doing this look right now, and I feel gothic. I've never had this much makeup on before. I feel like I have a full black circle around my eye. What have I done to myself? Oh my gosh! Hey guys, I'm just joking. I'm showing you how to do scene makeup. Scene as an emo. How can anyone do their eye makeup when their eye is watering like a butter fountain? I don't understand. There's a double dutch.